So you need to know about our solar system. And our solar system comprises of a sun, uh, which is a star, and then we have eight planets, and you need to know them in order, and they are Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. But then you also need to know about what's in the universe as a whole. And so we've got comets, and comets are made of ice and dust, and they will orbit a star. And we've got meteors, which are rocks which fly through the universe, and they can get very hot when they enter the Earth's atmosphere and burn up. And you've got galaxies, which are massive groups of stars all together, and they're very big. And obviously you've got planets, and planets are objects that go around, that orbit a star. And lastly, you've got black holes, which are when stars die, all the matter compresses together to form a very dense, small object, which is very, very massive. So, we know the Earth goes round the Sun. This is the Earth, that's the Sun. But why does it go round in a circular way? Why do bodies orbit in a circular motion? Well, there's the Earth, and I know that there's a force of gravity attracting it to the Sun. We can call that a centripetal force. Now, the Earth wants to go that way, but the force of gravity is pulling it towards the Sun, so as it goes round, it keeps on being pulled towards the Sun by that centripetal force and that means that in effect it travels all the way round in a circle and this slide coming up shows that.